Determination of Chlorides in Water, More Method. The practical lesson consists of the following section. Objective, Introduction, Materials and Reactants, Methodology, and finally, results. Objective. The objective is to determine the concentration of chloride in a water sample by the Morse method. Introduction. The chlorides react with the silver, forming silver chloride and a white precipitate. Until a precipitate of pinkish red appears, which indicates that it has reached the end of the assessment. Materials and reactants. The following materials are required to do the assay. 25 ml burette. Burette stand and clamps two 250 ml Meyer flasks, automatic pipette, beaker, pH meter, water sample problem, reactants, silver nitrate solution, potassium dichromate, acetic acid, sodium bicarbonate, distilled water. Methodology. Measure with a pipette 10 ml of water sample and pass it to a 250 ml Ellenmeyer flask. Then add about 50 milliliters of distilled water to dilute it. Add 3 or 4 drops of the indicator potassium chromate to 5%. Then test using a pH meter if the pH of the solution is between 6.3 and 10.5, otherwise the pH of the solution should be adjusted to this range. If the pH is less than 6.3, should be alkaline with sodium carbonate, sodium bicarbonate or borax. If the pH is greater than 10.5, it is acidified with acetic acid. Then proceed to make up to zero the burette with silver nitrate solution. Then you start to value with silver nitrate, adding the solution drop by drop, while stirring continuously the Erlenmeyer flask, until a precipitate of pinkish red appears, which indicates that it has reached the end of the assessment. Finally, record the volume of silver nitrate used in the assessment. Results. To calculate the concentration of chloride ions present in the water sample in grams per liter, we shall apply the following formulas. <laughs> 